Today's food uh, snack adventure will be Malona ice cream bars. I've never had these before. Um, I had a chance to get a mango one for free because the coworker brought one into work one time, but they all got eaten before I could get one. So I've never had them before. I was looking for mango, they didn't have mango. They have the honeydew and strawberry. I'm also gonna be trying ketchup Doritos, which I'll probably hate because, you know. And I also picked up these um, Prana um, no milk, chocolatey bark with hazelnuts and crispy rice. Uh, mainly because I have a friend who is allergic to dairy, so I'll try it and let her know. So let's begin with the Malona. I'm just going to take one out. I've heard really good things about these two, and uh, oh, they're not very big. Mm, they smell really good. These have no gluten. They're just like uh, little square bars. Mmm. That's really good. Mmm. They're a little sweet, but they're really good. Mmm. I'm digging that. On a hot day, mmm. I've been missing out, <laughs> for sure. So that was a nice, refreshing little treat. And now it's time to try the mel. Oh, I thought they'd be honeydew. These just say generic mel melon. Just it's a picture of a honeydew. Anyways, let's get it on. And these last a long time. I bought these. They say they're best before July 2022. So <laughs> they last for. Uh, about two years, so they're probably all chemical. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Not these ones. I'm not digging as much because very some of those fruit milks I've had strawberry superior than the melon flavor. Really strong melon flavor. Artificial, probably. This is the ingredients list. Mm. Milk, sugar, corn syrup, water, whey powder, melon syrup, lemon juice, stuff to make it ice cream, locust bean gum. Lots of locust bean gum. Mm. These are Korean snacks. Mm. So in addition to these two flavors, they also do um, coconut, and I saw, uh, what was the other one? I know mango exists. There's a little banana, there's also banana, but I don't think I'd like the banana one, because I don't like the taste of fake banana. All right, so the melon one wasn't too bad. I mean, it's not my favorite, but I would eat it if I was at someone's house and they offered it to me for free. But I wouldn't buy them again. Strawberry solid, and I have to try the mango still. And I'd probably try the coconut. Moving on, let's go to ketchup Doritos. You know, I'm probably gonna hate. I don't really like ketchup chips in general, so I don't even know why I bought these. But uh, they're not. They're they're reddish in color. They smell like ketchup, obviously. Not that bad. They're really crunchy like Doritos, but they have the powder and taste of a ketchup chip from Lay's. Mm. A little on the salty side, but okay. I mean, a fan of ketchup chips would like these. They're a little strong for me though. Time to try the Prana No Milk Chocolatey Bark with 40% cocoa. This wasn't cheap, by the way. It was like five dollars on sale from 5.50. Oh, did that wrong. There we go. I went deep enough. Okay, what do we got here? They look really chalky. 
they look really chalky. Yeah. Oh, these are shitty. They have the crunch, but it's less sweet because there's no milk, right? It's it's a pass for me, man. These are weird. I mean, obviously, for someone who's allergic to dairy, you could try them, but they're awful. I wouldn't. I wouldn't recommend this to anyone. Yeah. All right. So those are my thoughts on those snacks.